Hey guys, Digital David here. Today I'm going to be unboxing a Zomoto EasyCam. Here it is. Really excited for this. It will go right into the app with my current 8-channel security system that I have installed around my house. Now this is going to be an indoor camera, so it'll be fun just to have and see what's going on in my house as well. So, got this from Zomoto. I'll put the link in my description for you guys to go check it out on Amazon. Um, really excited for it. Again, it's the Zomoto Easy Cam. It's 720p HD camera, 125 degree field of view, 26 feet for night vision. I believe all this is the same as that system I have for my outside. Now, what's fun is this has a built in speaker and microphone. So there's two way audio on this little camera. So they're claiming on the box easy setup, HD video, two way audio, motion detection, remote access, night vision. So Here's how it comes packaged to you. See if I can get that close enough and you can try and maybe read some of that. Nothing special, but just a good little box. And now we'll go ahead and open it up and see what we got on the inside. Come on, whoops. First thing out of the box, your user manual. Looks pretty straightforward enough. Even has some advice if you want to mount your camera. So set that aside. Here's how the camera comes packaged to you. Really excited. It looks really cool. Ooh, it's pretty little. Wow. Wow, I'm actually I'm actually really impressed. So I guess you could even mount it this way if you wanted as well. So nice metallic stand. The whole thing actually seems metal. So here's how it comes to you just with some plastic on. I'm really, I'm really impressed. I was not expecting this. I used to have one of those old little D-Link Wi-Fi or wireless cameras like this too, and it was just really cheap. But this is awesome. I'm really, really excited. So there's that. And then inside the box, what do we have? Some screws and anchors if you'd like to mount it. And last but not least, we have the power supply which is just a micro USB. Should plug right in the bottom there. Ta-da! And you're all good to go. So nice nifty little power brick. Looks like a, a decent enough cable in length. Yeah, I'm going to guess that's a little over six feet from plug to tip. So great. That'll give you enough space to try to put it in a couple creative areas in your house or if you want to mount it somewhere too you have some distance to go so if not you can use an extension cord just a little two prong plug so thanks for watching this video check the link in the description and stay tuned for the next one thanks